Olympic gymnast Gabby Douglas is on top of the world after grabbing the all-around gold medal. But America's new hero just got another thrill, which practically had her doing back handsprings all over again. You are a big fan of a certain show. <laughs> Hi, Gabby. Hi, Gabby. Hi, Gabby. Hi, Gabby. <laughs> Hi, Gabby. Hi, Gabby. Oh, my gosh. Gabby was speechless. A permanent smile stuck on her face. Damon blew me a little kiss. <laughs> I caught it. <laughs> and I have another cool thing. Um, Entertainment Tonight would like to officially offer you the chance to be a guest correspondent for them when you get back to the U.S. And your first assignment will be to go and cover on the set of the Vampire Diaries show. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I accept. <laughs> and we know you're going to do a great job, Gabby. Hi. Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you? Oh, good. <laughs> I think we're both a little starstruck right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, there's Nina, <laughs> there's Gabby. And uh, we don't get gold medals. We have a little surprise for you. Okay, so do you remember in Park City when you told me that you have a huge crush on Taylor Swift? I remember. Well, it turns out that we know people in high places, and we <laughs> made a quick phone call and take a look. Hey, it's Taylor. I just wanted to say good luck to everybody going to Sochi. I wanted to wish all the winter athletes luck. And Torin, thanks for listening to my music while you practice. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on. What Taylor do you think Swift. of that? She, she knows your name. name. She yep. said your name. Yep. I would like to. Thank you, Taylor Swift, for telling me good luck and uh, tell her that she's one of the most beautiful people to walk on this planet. We have somebody who wanted to do a quick little shout out for you, so I'm going to play you a little clip. Okay? Hi, it's Emma. I just want to say hi to Nick and good luck to all of the Winter Olympians. Uh, <laughs> what a doll. We happen to hear that you liked her and she wanted to do a shout out just for you, so what do you have to say back to Emma for doing that? Emma, um, if, if, if we ever meet up, we ever cross paths, I'd love to just hang out for five minutes. That's all I ask. <laughs> Speaking of people who know who you are, we actually have a little shout out from somebody for you. What? It's a surprise, so. What? I don't know if you know who this person is, but I think you might. Oh my gosh, why? So watch this and take a look. Hey, hey, hey it's Keith here with Jim. Hi guys, sending all our love to all the Olympians, all the athletes out there in Sochi. Yeah, everyone kicking it and uh, Way to go. Hey, Jason! <laughs> Woo! You oh my gosh, stop! No, 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 no. <laughs> oh my gosh, stop! No, oh my god, I'm, I'm obsessed with her. Oh my god. So I like that was, of course, cool. oh my gosh. Jennifer Lopez, oh and she no. said your name. Oh my god, she said my name. She knows my name. That doesn't, that's, see, like, surreal. Like, that doesn't happen in real life. And Meryl, I heard that you're a fan of Downton Abbey, is that right? I'm a huge fan, yeah. So we actually have something to show you. Gracie and Meryl, I hear that you are at the Winter Games and picked Downton as your favorite show. Yes. Um, have a brilliant time and good luck. You are far more graceful and brilliant. I'm sure you'll be great. Have a great time. Hi Jessica, uh, or Sybil as I know you from Downton Abbey. I want to say thank you for the shout out. It's so exciting. Um, watching the show helps me stay calm when I'm nervous before a competition and it's so enjoyable for me. So I want to say thank you so much. Charlie Cullen Waters reporting for The Insider caught up with him outside the iceberg to talk fashion and social media. I've talked to people who have not been watching the hockey, not been watching the skiing, but watching your Instagram. Johnny's Volvo. This is where we eat. The pair have made a big splash at Sochi coordinating outfits. Their influence might be spreading to the Today Show. Who could just use, you know, a little bit of Johnny Terra Spark? I, I would like to put Willie in my silver sequin blazer from, from the men's free skate. Valentine's Day is coming up. If you guys had to give a Valentine to one athlete crush, you've interviewed a lot, who are you each going to pick? I'll go Jamie Anderson from the slope style snowboard. Just she was so cool and she's does such a good sport. I'll go Gus Kenworthy. So he's trying to save the puppies here in Sochi. And Al? I, I guess I go Lolo Jones. You know what they say about opinions, Charlie, right? I'm not going to say it on the air. <laughs> hey, ET, it's Charlie from Olympics or Bust. I am here on the Thames River. Well, we've been here in London. A lot of fans on Twitter have been asking if you could gold medal in any Olympic sport, real or fictional. I think it would dress and drag and go for the women's hammer throw. I said, black people don't float. And she was like, what do you mean? I said, I just can't float. She said, you can float. And I said, whatever. I just, you know, long, and I don't know any of my friends that can float. I might get the gold medal for sprinting in the pouring rain with a halo on. I think my name might be Jennifer Missy, Corn Missy Franklin Garner. What's your favorite summer Olympic sport? 
Um, I love swimming events and I love bobsled. So hopefully uh, those ones will be on and I'll be able to be there and watch them. Hate to disappoint Kellen, but bobsled, not a summer sport. But we still love you.